Mark Peterson and the Extreme Team have been hard at work remodeling the Military and Veterans Resource Center at Whitworth University. Now this is what it looked like before they got busy. Mark's now ready to reveal the makeover. The center was created to give the university's military members and veterans ROTC cadets a place to study and serve as a spot for outside veterans organizations to work with students. Let's send it over to Mark Peterson for the big reveal. The first flag raising of the new flagpole at Maverick, Military and Veterans Resource Center, Whitworth University, Army ROTC in charge of that. Thank you. Um, that is now at half staff because of former Secretary of State Madeleine Albright. Welcome to the reveal of what has been a huge project. We now have, again, ADA more a sidewalk all the way up and an easy entrance into what is a resource center for those connected to the military. It's midterms at Whitworth and we have seen a lot of students, military people here studying and also helping when they have time. We're going to take you up onto what is now the new patio. That patio will allow for, well, they've had some, um, they've had groups of 20 or 30 here trying to do a barbecue, uneven ground. It's, it was multiple level. Now it's all one level. It's all accessible and it's all very clean and new. Uh, Coal Concrete did an absolutely amazing job. Central Premix jumped in. We want to thank them. Uh, we do have a couple of things that are new now. We have a fire pit. And I gotta tell you, it, it's the coolest thing in the world because it doesn't have propane. It uses wood pellets like you would use in your barbecue. So it's there for the enjoyment on the cool nights. And uh, Country Homes Power, thank you very much for helping us out. Behind that is a custom made military style bench from Titan Truck. We have come in and we put in a new retaining wall, all the new concrete and a compass to guide them. This is one of those cool things that just breaks up the gray of the concrete and really says welcome home. This Maverick Military and Veterans Resource Center will be used for years to come and this will live longer than that house. It's been pretty cool. We also have behind the house as we showed you last hour the pergola, the place to sit, the place to play cribbage, to discuss, to talk, to study or just to take a break. And on top of that we're going to show you a couple other things. The sizzle of feeding a bunch of uh, hungry college students and for those who showed up for our reveal. Uh, so far, about 50 people have come in, but guess what? This is Wagyu beef. This comes out of Oregon and the Munding family sponsored this dinner, so we thank them. But also, it's a pit boss. This is gonna stay here. This is so they can have a grill and have barbecue. But if they need long form barbecue, the Green Mountain Grill from FMI. And uh, again, we wanna thank them. These are gifts to Maverick that are gonna stay here for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, or maybe it's the long cook with the Green Mountain Grill. Bottom line is, from now until the foreseeable future, we're gonna have the armed forces connected with Whitworth capable of being together and having community. And that's what it's all about. This has been this month's Extreme Team. We want to thank Horizon Credit Union for jumping on board and helping us out. Plus, they were here every single day. I'm Mark Peterson for the Extreme Team, our big reveal of Maverick, right here on 4 News Now.